too, man. I hope you guys are having a fantastic Friday night. What a beautiful sight right there. As we're starting game two of this four-game series here against the Giants. We beat them last night looking to win this one tonight. As uh, it's pretty possible with our starting pitcher in Dustin May, who's on the mound. We are 141 uh, and 11 as Dustin May's on the mound. Like I said, this is his 24th start. 17-2, a 1.76 ERA, 153 and two-thirds innings, 103 hits, 10 walks, 201 strikeouts, and I got some wild card news. The Arizona Diamondbacks have officially clinched their spot into the postseason, so they'll be there. They can go on a losing streak if all they care, and they can rest all their players because now they know they're in the postseason. Rockies, Diamondbacks, Dodgers, all from the West. Going into the 2023 postseason. So that's a strike to start this ball game from Dustin May to Austin Slater, who hit a home run yesterday. The 0 1 sinker hit Freeman. <clears throat> one away. One away here in the top half of the first. Dodgers win their 11th straight yesterday, looking to win their 12th straight here today. And we got a pretty good guy on the mound to get that job done in Dustin May. This is going to be May's. Last start of 2023. No, no, not of 2023. Last start here at home this season. We'll have probably one more on the road. Oh, one sinker, 0 oh, and two. And uh, uh, 2 to Estrada. The sinker. Got him. Made him wait. Two away here in the top of the first. Well, oh, they'll bring up Mitch Hanniger. Getting 2.43. First pitch hit into right. Betts will get there. A 1-2-3 inning for Dustin May. He'll take it. All right, tonight, Alex Cobb on the mound for the Giants. This is his 30th star, 8-13, a 4.41 ERA. 161 and one-thirds innings. More innings pitched this year than Dustin May. But Dustin May did spend time on the IL this year. 181 hits, 52 walks, 112 strikeouts. And Milky Betts will lead it off, hitting 275, 43 bombs, 88 ribbies, and playing his first game here against the Giants. Three more to go at home, and Milky knows that. Had yesterday off, and then seven on the road, and then postseason baseball. It's going to be nice. I can't believe it's right around the corner. I'm pretty excited. I know you guys are excited. 0-2 to Milky Betts, and I know this Dodger ball club is excited. The 0-2 from Cobb. Got him. One away here in the bottom of the first. I'm going to blame my dog on that strikeout. Because she was spinning and moving the bed and messed up my eye angles. So it messed up my focus. I'm kidding. I'm kidding, Coco. Don't worry. You're not going to blame the dog, right? Deal one. One and one from Cobb. Pitch is in. And the 1-1 one, one. to Altman, hitting 355. Leads the Dodgers in batting average and hits. The 2-1. Two, 2-2. Two two. Two the 2-2. Two, two. Hit into center. And that will be caught. Two away. Bob to Freeman, 0 and 2. Oh, 
In the left, that ball's gonna drop. That's gonna be a double for Freddie Freeman. So, two out double, and now that'll bring on Max Muncy. Cubs win 3 2 against the Rockies. That means they needed the Cardinals to lose. The first pitch, hammer! And it's a 2 0 ball game, a splitter. That just did not split and was not a good pitch to Muncie. The Reds won one in the tenth. They're trying to hold on to their NL, I mean, yeah, their NL Central lead. Smith hitting 330. 2-0 thanks to Max Muncy. Last night it was 2-0 in the first thanks to uh, Nolan Arenado. So Dodgers back-to-back -back nights with home runs in the first inning. The 1-2. 2-2. Two. Two and two. Two from Cobb. Will be hit into center. A two out single for Will Smith to keep this inning alive. To bring up Arenado. <clears throat> oh no, David Peralta, excuse me, hitting 309. DHing today is DP. First pitch fouls it off on one. from Cobb. I think Nolan actually has tonight off. 1-2. From Cobb, 2-2. Two and two. Because DP is DHing and Max Muncy's playing third. By the way, Max Muncy is in line to win a gold glove at third base when he's been DHing all the year, all year by the way. Like, he's leading third baseman in fielding, which is crazy to me because he doesn't even play third. And the third baseman, Silver Slugger, I mean, that's where he started this season. So I guess he's played enough games there to win it. As I'll bring up uh, Mike Kostremski. The slugging one I get, but Gold Glove, like, you don't play there enough to earn it or even accept it. I mean, get it. I mean, he played there. For maybe like two months, and then Arenado's been there for the rest of the year for the Dodgers, but we'll take it. The 0-2, I, I guess. The 0-2 from Dustin May, 1-2. 1-2, and two. One ball, two <clears throat> one, two, heater. Hit into left center. Taylor, one away. <clears throat> one away for May. See what I did there? Huh. And now that'll bring up Wilmer Flores. Getting 237. First pitch sinker. Ball one. 1 0. Fast ball to Flores. 1 and 1. Right down the middle. Dustin May, August pitcher of the month. Trying to do the same thing here in September. Two away. Also, Noah Syndergaard is third in voting for the NL Cy Young Award. Gonsolin still leads. I bring up uh, Luciano. Fouled off 0-1. 0-1 sinker. And fouled 0-2. So 
Row 2. The slurve hit Freeman will end the top of the second. Dodgers still lead 2 0. And CT3 will lead off the bottom of the second, hitting 320. Cobb with his first pitch will be low ball one. Cobb, 22 pitches in the first two runs given up thanks to that Max Muncy home run. Hit. Up the middle. One away. The Guardians are about to win another AL Central title. They'll bring up D Strange Gordon hitting 250. Vargas with, with the night off tonight. First pitch. Foul it off on one. Gordon knows there's pretty much a week. Well, let's think. A week. There's pretty much nine more games for D. Gordon in the 2023 regular season. So he's going to try and do as much as possible and get as much playing time as possible. First pitch to Adamus Ball 1 as he gets a hit there with one away here on the bottom of the first does Gordon. 1-0 to Willie Adamas. Hit into center, and that's going to drop for a base. Oh, my God, I lied. What a catch from the giant center fielder, and they will not double him up, though. Gordon's too fast. What a catch, though, from Austin Slater and center robbing Willie, Do Willie Adamas of a hit. Now that bring a Mookie Betts 0 for 1. Got to be a little bit frustrated. If you're really a dom that's getting robbed of a hit. 1 and 0. Oh. 1 and 1. I think the 1 1 to bets from Cobb. 2 and 1. Good speed at first. Anything in the gap might score Gordon. 2 1. 3 2 and 2. And two. Good splitter. <clears throat> 2 2. There goes Gordon. Str str swinging and missing his Mookie Betts. Then the second, I wanted to say struck him out, but I didn't know what I was going. I didn't know what I was going, where I was going with that. And then the second. All right, Dustin May will lead, I mean, well, Colton Walker will lead off the top of the third. May with his first pitch of the third. It will be his 19th of the outing, high ball one. 1-0. One -oh. Fastball one and one. Back the back heaters for Dustin. The 1-1 one, one slurve. 1-2. One 1-2 two. One, two cutter. Got him. I think. Go. Yep, one away here in the top of the third. And now that will bring up Ford Proctor. 233 for the Giants. First pitch, swung on a miss, 0-1-1. One, one. Oh, one. Oh, one cutter. Foul it off, 0-2. Oh, 0-2. Oh, Sinker got him, two away. Back to back punch outs for Dustin May. And now that'll bring up Zach Nito hitting 194. Acquired. One zero. Acquired from the Angels earlier this season. The Crawford trade, one and one. Crawford going to the postseason as the Giants are not. So Crawford's pretty happy that he's going to the postseason one more time in his career. With the Los Angeles Angels, they think they've slowed down a little bit. The Angels, which is okay. The one two heater fouled off. The one two cutter. 
will be fouled off. Best team in the American League, the Angels. Best team in the National League, the Dodgers. Both have bye weeks. Or not bye weeks, but bye series in the postseason. Maybe, maybe we'll call Mike Trout and wish them good luck and hopefully we'll see him in the World Series if we make it. Strike one, a lot of good teams in both postseason brackets. Deal one, fastball low, hit into left center. Taylor will get there to end the top of the third. Man, I thought Austin Slater maybe had himself another home run. Hit one yesterday. That's kind of the same exact location from yesterday, so... May gets to wipe his forehead off a little bit and go sit on the bench and be glad it's still 2-0. The the that'll bring up Outman. 0 for 1. Cobb, 33 pitches. 0 for 1. Ball 1 inside. 2023 NL All-Star. The 1-0. 1-1. One Dodgers up thanks to Max Muncy, who we'll see in this inning. Two and one. A two one from Cobb. Fouled off two and two. Really rough year for the Giants. Pitching staff, offense, a lot of trades that are questionable. Logan Webb. Uh Jock Peterson. I mean, it helped the it helped the Reds out for sure, but the Giants are just not having what they wanted in 2023. The 3-2 hit, terrible swing, uh, one away here in the bottom of the third. And they bring up Freddie, one for one, doubled in his last at bat. First pitch, high ball one. The 1-0. One, oh. one and one. The one one. One and two. All right, the one two. Hit off of Cobb to away here in the bottom of the third. Perfect ricochet, right? As, as Estrada makes the play, a 1-4-3 put out. They'll bring up Max Muncy, one for one. Hit, and that will be a base hit. A single for Muncy. Muncy still trying to fight to win that MVP. Tony Gonsolin doing the same thing last night against the Giants. Ended up giving up one run in his seven innings pitched. Muncy with another home run tonight and another base hit. 1-0. There goes Muncy. The pitch from Cobb will be a strike, but they're going to throw out Muncy to end the third. Darn it. Well, uh, Strada will lead off the top of the fourth. 0 for 1. Three good innings from May. 0-1. Only one hit allowed. 0-1. Cutter hit into left. Taylor one away. <clears throat> one away, and now they'll bring a Mitch Hanniger. Over four in the series. Over one tonight. That will be hit. Gordon will dive. Will stop the ball. That'll be the first hit for Hanniger in the series. As D. Gordon can't make the play, but it's an infield single. And now they'll bring up Mistrumski as the tying run. Go for one. Grandson of Carl Ustremski. And one. Former Red Sox. Zero one fastball. One and one. One one. Hit Muncie. Double play ball. One and two. Ten the top of the fourth. You know what's crazy with the Giants is they have three players with 13 home runs. That are tied for first on the Giants. That's crazy. 
<laughs> like that, that's that's insanely low. Yeah, Will Smith would lead off the bottom of the fourth. One for one. Singled earlier. First pitch hit down to short. One away. Yeah, they'll bring up DP. 0 for 1 with that strikeout earlier. First pitch from Cobb. Strike one. Deal one. Hit. Estrada. Two away. I keep playing this Giants team. It still feels like we're playing the Tigers for some reason. I don't know why. But it does. First pitch from Cobb. Hit into center. And a base hit for CT with two away. Reds end up winning. Two to one. In Cincinnati against the Pirates. First pitch to Gordon 0-1. 1-4-1. One. One one, singled earlier. The 1 pitch. In the left. The splitter will end the fourth. Right. First pitch to Wilmer Flores. He's 0-1. for one. Circle change. Check one. Yeah, one. Fastball, one and one. One and one. The cutter popped up. Smith, easy play. One away. And I bring up Luciano, 0 for one. First pitch heater, strike one. Deal one heater. One and one. I feel like May has not had his best stuff tonight, but it's probably the fact. But we're playing with Giants who are absolutely terrible this season. Just making it look good. The one two slurve got him. Two away. Probably the best pitch of the night right there for May. Two away here in the top of the fifth. And now that'll bring up Colton Welker. Go for one. First pitch high, ball one. One oh. One and one. One one sinker. Two and one. Two one fastball to Walker. Foul off two and two. Two two circle change. Will be hit down to third Muncie. Will end the top of the fifth. I mean I will say Max Muncie does play a good third baseman when he's over there at the hot corner. It's probably why he's done and probably won a gold glove. Oh, really, Adamus will lead off the bottom of the fifth. First pitch, strike one. Deal one. One and one. Hit. It bobbled. Estrada will still get the out. I'm going to bring a Mookie Betts. One for two. Struggling tonight against Cobb and the Giants. 0-1. And, and two for four. Wednesday night against the Tigers. That's hit down to short. Two away. Two away and now that will bring up Outman 0 for one. I mean 0 for two, excuse me. Swung on a miss, doing one. Yeah, one from Cobb. One and one. one, 
Hit, and that will land the bottom of the fifth. Darn it. Sweet contact in the bottom of the fifth for Cobb and the Giants. Dodgers still lead 2-0. Well, Proctor will lead off the top of the sixth, though, for one. First pitch, strike one. No one cutter from May. Hit, Gordon. Can't make the play. Base hit here in the top of the sixth. Third hit of the night for the Giants. And now that will bring up Nito. One for one. First pitch, cutter. Hit. Gordon dives, throws the first one away. Good play from D. Gordon showing off the uh, defense. They've been picking on him all night, and Gordon's happy he finally made a play. And now that will bring up Austin Slater over two. First pitch, popped up, easy play for Adamas. Two away. Two away, and now that will bring up Estrada. If I just said Estrada popped up, I meant Slater. Ball one. 1-0. One -oh. Peter. 1-1. One one. One one, slur, one and two. One one two, sinker, got him. To end the top of six. They'll probably end the night for Dustin May. Six good innings, and I think we're just gonna call it a night here with Dustin. And start warming up. Bruce Star Gratterall. <clears throat> First pitch from Cobb. Ball one. The 1 0. Hit. That ball will not get through, but it will be an infield hit. As that ball will bounce off Estrada's glove. And now Gabe Kapler has seen enough. And now they're going to bring in Joe Ross with a 6.40 ERA. And he'll face Max Muncy. Two for two. Homer single. Four for six so far in the series. And the Giants pretty well. First pitch. Ball one. 16 double plays this year for Max Muncy. The 1 0. Hit into left center. That ball is going to be caught. And Freeman will get doubled up. Two away here in the bottom of the sixth. It's not a good read from Freddy. So now that'll bring up Will. First pitch. Hit into left. For a two out single. And now they'll bring up Peralto for two. First pitch. Ball one. All right, the one oh. To Peralta from Ross. Hit. Into right for a base hit. Will will stay a second. The left field, number three. Red. Oh, bring up Taylor, one for two. <clears throat> First pitch. Hit. That's gonna sneak up the middle. Will coming around home to home. Uh, Peralta will go into third and runners will be at the corners with two away. The job of CT just muscling that one up the middle. Now that'll bring up Gordon and Ross is having a tough time ending the sixth. 
This pitch to Gordon. That's hammered into right. And Taylor will stay at second. It's a 4 0 game. <clears throat> Dodgers add to their lead here in the bottom of the sixth. That'll bring up Adamas. He's 0 for 2. First pitch to Adamas. Swung on a miss. That one won. The struggling Willie Adamas. And Big Gordon's probably hoping, hey, maybe. Maybe I could take that shortstop position in the postseason and help this Dodgers team win a World Series. But the thought is, is that Willie Adamas is going to stay with the postseason roster in the team. Because, yeah, obviously, uh, we're going to need him. The one, two. Got him. Very tough stretch for Adamas. Now we're going to bring in Bruce Targaratterall. This is his 35th game, 42 and two-thirds innings this year, a 1.05 ERA, 54 strikeouts, no walks. Looking to have a 1-2-3 inning here, first pitch, ball one. Would like just to get through this seventh with Gratterall. I'm not trying to extend him, just wanting to have a good inning here, one and one. One and one, slider, one and two, good pitch. One, two, heater. Two and two. Two, two. Cutter fouled off. Two, two. Sinker popped up. Two, two. Fouled off. Yeah, two two. Peter hit in the left fouled. Two two. Slider fouled off. Staying alive. Two two fastball hit Adamus one away here in the top of the seventh for the Giants. A lot of pitches throwing and that is not what I wanted Gratterall to do, but it happened. First pitch to Ustremski. Nope. Ball one. And a one zero. One and one. I feel like Gratterall's confidence has really gone down ever since giving up those runs. I mean, ERA was at a 0 0.68. And in this week, it's gone to a 1.05. That's rough. The 1 2 fouled off. He's having a hard time getting out. The 16th pitch. Did he go? Yep, two away here on the top of the seventh. I think the third base umpire helped out Gratterall just a smidge. Because I don't think he went around. First pitch to Wilmer Flores. Slider fouled off. Diamondbacks against the Yankees this weekend. Looks like they won tonight 8-2. to 0-2 to Wilmer Flores. 0-2. Cutter. 1-2. and two. Good take. One, two. The fastball popped up into center. Outman will get there to end the seventh. One, two, three inning for Gratterall, and that will end his night. Had a lot of pitches to work through that. Not what we wanted to see from Gratterall, but he also did what I asked him to do, and that was to get the three outs. Well, oh, Ryan Pepio warming in the Dodgers bullpen. First pitch from Ross. Hit into left. One away here in the bottom of the seventh. They didn't really have to move out there. Did uh, Ustremski. That'll bring up Altman 0 for 3. First pitch from Ross. Ball 1. 
Padres beating the Cardinals. Yeah, that's hitting the right. That ball's hammered. That ball is caught to the leg. Darn it. Good play from Mitch Hanniger. Now that would bring up Freddy. Two for three. First pitch foul on one. Three one. Oh and two. You go two to Freeman. One and two. Oh, the one two from Ross will be a foul ball. The one two. Fouled off. Got him. Ten to seven. Good pitch. Pepio ready to come out of the bullpen. Oh, here comes Pepio. This is his fourth game. Eleven innings on the year. A 1.64 ERA. Fifteen strikeouts, no walks so far this season. In the short stint he's been here with the Dodgers. First pitch to Luciano. Hit and fouled 0 and 1. 0 1. 0 and 2 with the circle change. 0 2 cutter. Got him one away here in the top of the eighth. Good cutter right there from Pepio. And now that will bring up Welker. 0 for 2. First pitch. Fouled off on one. Friday night here. Have Syndergaard tomorrow and then Clayton Kershaw. One last time here at Dodger Stadium. In the 2023 regular season. We'll have a final start. Year two. Fastball fouled. And then we'll see Bueller Monday against the Rockies, and then Bueller next Sunday against these Giants, who away here in the top of the eighth. The next start for Kershaw will be Saturday of next week against these Giants as well. So the next two starts for Clayton Kershaw comes against these Giants. Oh, one fastball hit into right foul on two. Go two, sweeping curve, got him. Great pitch from Pepe to end the top of the eighth. That was filthy. Proctor probably gonna go look back when he has a second to watch that pitch on film and just look how nasty it was. All right, Max Muncy will lead off the bottom of the eighth. Eleven hits, four runs for the for the Dodgers tonight. Two of those runs from Muncy earlier in the first. Dodgers added on. In the sixth. One and one. Ross has been out there for a minute for the Giants. The only pitcher coming out of the bullpen so far. He's done his job. Two and one. From Ross. Two and two. Go two two. Three and two. With the payoff, ball four. Walk for Max. And now that'll bring up Will Smith, two for three. First pitch. Swung on and missed, one one. Trying to attack that pitch. Deal one. Hit. Double play ball one and two to end, well, to record two here in the bottom of the eighth. And now that'll bring up David Peralta. 
One for two, one for three. Okay, in the left. That ball will be caught to end the bottom of the eighth. All right, first pitch to Nito. One for two. Strike one. Giants down to their final three outs here in the top of the ninth. Dodgers lead 4-0. Pepio knows his job, and that's to end this ball game. One and one. Hit. Gordon. One away here in the top of the ninth. Miguel Vargas will be back in the lineup tomorrow. First pitch to Slater. Strike one. 0 for 3. Hit a home run yesterday. 0 1 slider. Hit. Freeman. 2 away. Giants down to their final out. In Estrada. One for three. Hit and foul going on. And one slider. Oh and two. Oh, two sweeping curves. So Pepio will. And, oh, great take. Doesn't say we'll end this ball game, but. Just did not get the call, the one two heater. We'll be hand to right bets. We'll get there to end this game here on this Friday night at Dodger Stadium. We win 4 0. An absolute kind of a quiet game, to be honest. Uh, just, just took care of business for our 12th win in a row. Nothing too crazy tonight. And, uh,. Pepio did his thing, Dustin May gets his 18th win of the year. He pitches only six innings, which I kind of feel like wasn't the goal, but that's what he was able to do. And Muncy, man, with another home run. Just absolutely insane. Season for Max. Like, comment, and subscribe, turn those post notifications. Player of the game goes to Dustin May. Five strikeouts, three hits, six innings. And, uh,. I'll end it. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on those post locations. I'll see you guys tomorrow.